If you were to go to a store for high quality TV displays, among many others you would indeed be offered with quantum dot LED TVs. Or, if you were given instructions to illuminate an important portrait, for example in art galleries, but using LEDs of highest efficiency currently available on the market, which at the same time can reproduce the colors on the painting as perfect as daylight, then be sure that you cannot find better choice than to use quantum dot LEDs. But what are quantum dots? Uh, quantum dots are tiny particles of less than 10 nanometers in diameter, and this is 10,000 times narrower than human hair. Quantum dots absorb a specific wavelength or color of light and then convert it to a longer wavelength or light color. And the color they emit depends on their size. So, for example, smaller quantum dots will emit green, while larger quantum dots will emit red light. This means that by controlling only quantum dot uh, synthesis, their chemical composition is always the same and only the number of atom changes, we can get particles that emit any color from the spectrum. And this is important in LED industry because it allows us to tailor the spectrum of an LED however we want. Most of the quantum dot-based products currently available on the market contain cadmium, but cadmium is highly cancerogenic. My research is based on cadmium-free indium phosphide quantum dots and their application on LEDs uh, considering their thermal and optical behavior. The quantum dots usually come exactly as you can see in the picture, dispersed in solvent. Of course, the solvent has to be removed before their application on LEDs. So, the quantum dots are mixed into the polymer matrix, imagine something like transparent balloon, and then applied to the LED package. The center of the LED package is diode, which in this case emits blue light. Depending on the composition and concentrations on the quantum dots here on the blue LED package, finally we can get white, red or green LED. In fact, I am experimenting on how to make good LEDs using indium phosphide quantum dots. For example, uh, we have already developed a high-performance white LED, which has high color rendering ability and its spectral efficiency is only 4% lower than its cadmium-based opponent currently available on the market. For the end, the next time you see quantum dot-based products, check if they are eco-friendly and cadmium-free.